This week, as we open the Torah, we find ourselves in the beginning of the book of Exodus. And it's in the beginning of that book that we first see Moses as a baby, put into the river, and then taken out by Pharaoh's daughter and raised in Pharaoh's palace. Ultimately, he commits that crime of killing the taskmaster and being sent off, running away to Midian, where he marries and has children and starts his life there. And it's as a shepherd in the desert that Moses comes into contact with that burning bush, the bush that's being burned by fire but not being consumed. And Moses, Moses had the ability to see that that bush was not being consumed, that it was simply flame surrounding the bush and going through the bush, but that the wood and the leaves of that bush were not being consumed. And so we pause to think about what the miracle really was as Moses interacts with God in that way. And perhaps, as Rabbi Cohn and others have said, the miracle truly is that Moses had the ability to stop and see that the flame was not consuming the bush. Most of us would have walked right by. Seeing a bush on fire in the desert doesn't seem all that strange. Yet to pause and to truly see the divine in that moment, to see that it was not being consumed. If only we could do that in our everyday lives. If we could stop and see the holiness that is in the world instead of just passing it by. Maybe this week we can.